On a rainy summer day, I decided to take my puppy camping overnight in the forest. Here, the climate was cool, the scenery was beautiful, and the fresh air made it an ideal place to relax after stressful days of work. Inside the small tent, cooking my favorite meals. Playing with my dog. And watching the raindrops fall was truly wonderful. Even more exciting was witnessing the dawn in this beautiful place. It was indeed an amazing experience for me. Join me for a chill camping experience online through the video below. On a cool, rainy day, I'll take you camping and chilling in the forest. Driving a bit, and we've arrived at the camping spot. Today, I brought my pet to keep me company and enjoy the beautiful scenery. The surroundings here are truly amazing. And I feel refreshed. Seizing the opportunity while it's drizzling, I'll put on a raincoat and prepare to set up the tent. I'll also put a small raincoat on my little dog so she doesn't get her fur wet. Now let's start setting up the camp. First, I'll use a smartly designed rain shelter. I'll secure one end of the shelter to my car. So even if it's windy, it won't fly away. Next, I'll use a hammer to set up sturdy stakes. Finally, I'll set up the supporting bars. And now I have a solid rain shelter. With the shelter set up, I'll take off the raincoat to cool down a bit. Now, let's set up the tent. I bought a foldable, smart tent, so setting it up is very easy. It only takes a few minutes to set up the tent. My little dog seems to really like it. Put the air mattress down to sit on and keep warm. My little dog is hungry. Okay. So I'll feed her a bit. Now, let's organize and arrange our belongings. For this trip, I brought a lot of things like a cooking stove, chairs, food, and other necessary items. After a bit of rest and playtime with my dog, I'll continue working.
In the forest, it gets dark quickly due to the rain. So I'm adding a few more lights for illumination. The night is cold, so I made sure to bring blankets and pillows. Do you find my dog cute? It's getting late, so I'll feed my dog first. After a short break, it's getting dark. So let's prepare dinner. First, I'll slice the potatoes, then soak them in water for 3-5 minutes. Next, I'll take them out and add some flour, salt, and pepper. Mix them well. Then, I'll heat the pan and add cooking oil. Once the oil is hot, I'll put the potatoes in. When they turn golden, I'll flip the pancakes. Making these potato pancakes isn't as easy as it seems. I almost messed them up. Now, Sprinkle some cheese and wait for five minutes. Can't have potato pancakes without a drink, right? Da da. Look, my delicious potato pancakes are ready. They look so appetizing. I'll plate them and enjoy. Wow, the taste is amazing. Eating it in the cool, rainy weather makes it even better. It's so delicious, I can't resist having more. Look, there are fireflies. They're lighting up the forest, making it so beautiful. I'll play with my dog inside the tent for a bit. My foot got stuck in my boot. It was a bit of a struggle to get it out. I'll dry my dog's paws. She ran around all day and got them wet. Look at her hungry face. Isn't she adorable? Let me show you how smart my dog is. Look, she can do many tricks, even shaking hands. I'll reward her with a snack. Look at her hungry and cute expression. It's getting late. And darkness has filled my tent. I'll turn off the lights and go to sleep. Have a good night's sleep, everyone.
the next morning. The rain has stopped. And the singing birds have awakened me. <laughs> Truly waking up in the midst of such a vast, mountainous landscape. And the pure natural air is indeed a wonderful experience. Now, I set up a table and brew some coffee. I love having coffee in the morning, so I've prepared all the necessary utensils. This manual coffee grinder is very convenient. Now, I'll pour the coffee powder into a filter bag and add hot water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> While waiting for the coffee to drip. I'll prepare breakfast. This morning, I'll have buttered toast with eggs. Please watch. My dog is too eager and snatches my toast. Now, I'll slice the bread in half and add a bit of scrambled egg filling. Invite you to enjoy breakfast with me. Taking a bite of the toast and a sip of coffee is a perfect breakfast. It's so delicious that I finished both slices of toast on my own. After breakfast, it's time for me to return home. I feel a bit sad, but it's okay. I'll come back here again someday. Packing up to go back to the busy life of work. I brought lightweight items, so assembling and disassembling are very easy. It only takes a few minutes to pack everything into my car. Thus concludes my solo camping trip in the forest. See you in the next exciting travel adventure.